Hello, my name is Felipe Neto. I'm from Brazil and this is the first video that I make in English in my channel. So I'm sorry for my accent, but English is not my first language. I'm making this video in English because I just saw the video from Asena O'Neill. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong. She was this model from Australia who had a career on social media, Instagram with a half million followers and a YouTube account with 200,000 subscribers and etc. And she decided to just abandon all that and make a video saying that social media Media is not real and everything that is around social media is something that you should basically say no to and abandon that and get to real life. She was really emotional and it really got me thinking and, and I started to think about my whole life and everything that I've been doing so far, everything that my life is about. I've been in social media for five years now. I created my first YouTube video that really got popular in April 2010 so since then my life has been a crazy roller coaster with millions and millions of subscribers and video views, followers, and everything that you can think about, money, party, women, and everything. And I gotta say that is fucked up. Yeah, that is fucked up. But I have something to say to you, Asina. I'm making this video in English exactly because of that, because I hope that maybe this video can reach you someday, that maybe you can watch this if maybe you decide to come back to YouTube and watch something. I don't know. But Asina, basically what I want to say is everything that you said, you have a point. You really have a point. And I know that everything that you're talking about is real for you. That your life turns into a, this huge competition with everybody that is making other videos or pictures or posting everything and you start thinking oh I need to reach that I need to be that I need to do that and I understand that but I'm here to tell you that you're also wrong you're also wrong and I want to say something not only to you but to the world that everyone that is sharing your video and saying oh let's talk about that let's discuss how social media is wrong and false and promotes this false idea of humanity well that is not true that is not how it works Asina, the first thing that I think you should understand and everybody else should understand is that there's a huge difference between an artist and a celebrity. And I like to see that difference based on everything that you said. When your life is about numbers, it's about exposure, it's about screaming, it's about fans, it's about what you get from what you're doing, you're not an artist, you're a celebrity. And that's what you were. I'm not saying this to offend you. You're the result of everything that society made you. And society made you a celebrity. You were not focused on content. You were focused on getting things back. And that is the definition of celebrity. That's the definition of people who make reality shows and have nothing to offer but everything to gain. That are focused on numbers and prizes. Artists are not focused on that. They don't give a shit about that. They don't care what they're gaining. They only care about producing content that they believe and that's the basic difference. And you don't need to be on TV or movies or anything else to do that. You can be in social media. When you made your video, you put everyone in the same basket. Everybody. And what's happening now is that everybody's sharing your video and talking about everything that you said and saying that people that are on social media and have careers on social media, they're all fake. They're all about numbers. They're all about getting things back. And that is not true. That is not true. In Brazil right now, we have every single media website or TV show or newspaper, everybody's talking about your video. And they're using your video to demote social media, to tell people social media is wrong, social media is bad. Let me tell you something. Social media was responsible for the majority of all of the latest protests all around the globe. In Brazil, 2013, we had the biggest protest in Brazil's history because of social media. For the first time, we're fighting back. For the first time, we know about everything that is wrong in our corrupted government, in our fucked up country because of social media, because of people using social media in the right way. So yeah, there are a lot of people using it in the wrong way. There are a lot of people promoting things they don't believe in. There are a lot of people doing shit that they don't believe believe in, but that is not everything that social media is about. I believe everything you said is extremely important to the world. Everybody should talk about that. Beauty pageants has been like all around the globe, especially in America, for decades. It's disgusting. And we have this beauty 
phenomenon that is all around Instagram and a lot of people following each other just because they're beautiful. And that is absolutely fucked up. We should discuss about that. Because if everything that you have to offer to the world is how beautiful you are, you have nothing to show to the world. You're nothing. Content should not be based on superficial things. It should be based on entertaining people. I'm not saying that all of my videos are deep and meaningful. No, they're not. But at least 90% of everything that I did so far, I always try to answer a question. Am I entertaining someone with this? If I'm not, I don't do it. I'm not saying I'm perfect. I did shit. For the last five years, I didn't make it right every time. But I understood the huge difference there is between being a celebrity and being an artist. So yeah, when you were 12, a scene, you got this contagious thing that is inside a lot of women, unfortunately, because of sexism. How we impose that women should be thin, should be beautiful, should wear makeup, and etc, etc. And you got that virus inside of you. You decided that you needed to be heard, but you didn't want to be heard. You wanted to be seen. You wanted to be beautiful. You wanted to be watched. So what I really think that your video is about is about celebrities and how celebrities should get the fuck out. How celebrities should not be followed. That is absolutely correct. We have so many women and men that their lives, their Instagram accounts, everything is based on how beautiful they are. And that is fucking stupid. That is fucking stupid. They have millions of followers, millions. And when you ask, what is this girl? Oh, she's a, a, a beauty thing. And I'm like, what the fuck is that? So everything she does is like, look how beautiful I am. And if you want to look as beautiful as I am, wear this makeup, buy this bikini, that is fucking retarded that is fucking stupid we should fight that because beauty is not content beauty is not something that help people it's not something that make people laugh make people think make people get entertained beauty make people envy and i say beauty about the concept of beauty that is stupid but don't say that everything on social media is stupid because it's not social media is really important to the world. And we have a lot of actors, a lot of actresses that finally have a chance to show their work, to show what they're capable of because of that. And you can't say that it's all fake because it's not. We have so many YouTube channels that are brilliant. They're made by artists that would never have a chance, never, before YouTube existed. So we can't put everything in the same basket and say, oh, okay, so PewDiePie is fake or Jenna Marbles is fake. I've been doing this for five years. I have almost five million subscribers in my channel and another eight million in my company's channel, Parfernalia. And uh, I gotta tell you, I had people crazy about me. I had people crying on the streets. When all of this started, the one thing that I focused on is I can't care about it. I can't let the approval of people, the likes or dislikes or the number of views control who I am. And that's what you should do. So if you want to abandon everything, like I don't want social media because social media is fake, that is your decision. And what you decide to do, I think people should support you. But have in mind that you didn't try enough. If you have something to say, if producing content makes you happy, if producing content is your dream, don't abandon your dream. But if everything that you have to show is how beautiful you are, yeah, I support you. You should leave social media. I'm really sorry if this is harsh, if this is not what you wanted to hear now, because you're going through a very bad moment in your life. But really, you're not abandoning because social media is bad. You're abandoning because you couldn't use it for good. You couldn't find the right way to use social media. So don't blame the social media. Blame how you used it. Blame the celebrities. Blame the culture of beauty. And after that, tell people that social media, yeah, it is good. We have a lot of good things going on because of it. So thank you for your video, but I honestly think you should get back and try harder.